roadside drink in a pedestrianised road can be pretty tempting. But if you push a pram or need to use a wheelchair, then the alfresco novelty soon wears off. Mick Scarlett explains why. Soho, the centre of London's cafe culture. OK, it's very continental, but a new report released today points out that it's not necessarily a good thing for those of us that find it hard to get around. The report published by the Keep Britain Tidy campaign backs up what wheelchair users and people pushing prams have been saying for years. That dirtier streets and all this street furniture are bringing down the quality of our lives. We have 24-hour cafe society and where we have uh, street furniture and we have things such as tables and chairs and advertising boards it's a real nuisance now for people that are in wheelchairs to get around and also the streets are grimy and it will mean that uh, you know things get stuck to wheelchairs and people uh, will generally find it really a poor experience it used to be said London streets were paved with gold nowadays it's litter old chewing gum moldy food and things I don't even want to mention but every day I have to wheel through them the responsibility to keep our streets clean and clear falls on the local council. We're waging a war against the sort of degradation that we've seen. For some reason, over the last five years in central London, the amount of litter and rubbish that people just simply thoughtlessly drop on the streets has also increased quite dramatically. Now, in some areas, we're winning the battle, and other areas, we're not winning the battle. And there's the proof. All the filth and litter from the streets go onto my wheels, and then onto my hands. So isn't it about time that we all started to clean things up? Mick Scarlett, BBC London News, going to wash his hands. <laughs> Poor old Mick. Now we'll show you the weather.